Driving you crazy. It's killing us. Uh -huh. um, it's killing us. It's a captain. Uh, you know, I take it upon myself. Situations like this to get us going. Um, I think about the last five games and the things that we've been doing. Um, I don't remember the last time we've been down like that. Um, I think about the way I played. And, uh, I wasn't here today. Mm -hmm. Point blank. Um, didn't show up today. Is, is, is that what you were kind of venting on the, on the sideline there in the third quarter? Just yeah, time I'm, I'm, I'm upset. You know, that I'm not playing the way I need to play. I put a lot of pressure on myself, and I've been playing a lot, playing good basketball. Yeah, we can be perfect. You know, you're not going to play every game the best you can. You know, you play five games, averaging 28. You know, uh, that's pretty good numbers. So you're not going to have good games all the time, but you have to do other things to help the team win. And I tried my best, but at the same time, I didn't do the necessary things to, to help win the ball game. As a team, we need to play better. Um, you know, we had a lot of turnovers. You know, that's what's been killing us. Um, we got to protect the ball. Um, and, and defensively, we need to stick within our defensive plan. We made it too easy for them out there. Um, we basically gave them the game. You know, you look at the score. You look at the, you know, the time. Two minutes ago, we're down by six. You know, uh, four minutes ago before the half, we're down by four. I mean, two minutes ago, we're down by four. We gave them the game. You know, we're a better team than that. We, we've gotten way much better. We got way better from the road. And uh, we just got to prove it, you know, um, and and keep playing. You've said a couple times lately, if this team's going to take the next step, we've got to clean up some of those things, right? Most definitely. We want to become the team that we we think we can be. We uh, we got to make those necessary steps, and that is understanding the level of consistency and bringing it every game. Are these kind of losses just frustrating because I mean, you, know, you know it's right there? It's just yeah, right it's frustrating because we're better than that than we showed today. We're way better than that. How do you build on How do you, you know, channel that frustration positively? We come to practice on Thursday. Mm -hmm. We practice extremely hard. Um, and also, uh, we do the necessary things to make changes for our team. How do you change the starts? I think um, your shots are not going to always fall. You know, I think defensively, we have to bring the tempo on that side as well. But I think that brings energy. We don't let those guys score. And, um, you know, we get getting the ball in the necessary hands that we need to get in, in the beginning of the game. And um, we just, we got to bring it on defense, I think. That, that, that's what hurts us. When we don't make shots, then we also give up, you know, you know, all the things, you know, it affects us. So we got to bring it on defense. Glenn, both tonight and uh, in Atlanta, you guys shot 38% from the field. Is that just Atlanta giving you certain looks and you guys just can't knock them down or what? I don't know. I can't put my hand on it. Um, just got to play better. Um, Friday, you know, Friday, you got Golden State. You played them a week and a half ago in their place. Um, talk about just the benefits of playing them so soon after you beat them in their place and just turn on the ain't film. No, and ain't no really benefits because they're ready to play. You look at how they've been playing. They've been playing extremely well. We went there to beat them. Uh, that was a game they wish they could have. Uh, they're coming to our place thinking they can beat us. So we got to you know, understand that this game is gone against Atlanta and come, come on with that. Thank you.